Hi, this is John in Los Angeles. Uh, what's the date today? I don't even know. Today is, I believe, the 28th. Okay, that's Paris. We're uh, preparing this uh, mural for Clean Air Day, guys. This is exciting. Look at this now. We're going to show you some of the stuff here that's not clean air and that they're getting away with here. So, what do you think here? The event is called Cl California Clean Air Day, and uh, it's something that everybody's supposed to participate in here in California on October 3rd. And what they're recommending that we do to keep the air clean is um, leave our car at home, oh, really. good plan. Bike to work, take public transportation, carpool to work, attend meetings remotely instead of driving, bring lunch or walk to lunch instead of driving. And then they also um, would like us to report polluting vehicles. Oh. They would like us to en encourage family and friends to take the pledge wherever they can to help keep the air clean, as well as quitting smoking. So what we've done is we've gotten this poster board together of what we think is not clean air. And it's something that we have not contributed to. As you can see, these are pictures of chemicals in the sky. They've been worsening and worsening since 2012. And quite frankly, I take umbrage with the fact that they're laying all of this responsibility on us, that we are the ones polluting the air when, as you can see, the skies are polluted by them. Big time. This is a constant, everyday battle that we're fighting here. And we're not getting anywhere, but yet they would like us to contribute to their clean air by quitting smoking or not driving yeah. a car. You've yeah. got to be kidding me. This looks like Halloween. Yeah, this right here, this was caused by somebody smoking right here. Yeah, sure. Can you tell? I would love for you to zoom in on this one, John, up here. Okay. Look right. at that. That's your pledge to clean air? Yeah, nice. Wow. Yeah, I'm buying that. There's something radically wrong here, and I'd I'd also like to mention the uh, uh, this one? the cell towers up here. Oh, sorry, going to this one here. Because not only are they polluting the air with chemicals, they're also polluting them with frequencies. Microwaves. With Microwave frequencies are just as bad of pollution as anything else. <laughs> Brain damaging, and then we got the ever popular sperm cloud. What is this, guys? What is this? This is not even geoengineering. I don't know what this is, but I'm sure it'll be out for Halloween. And look at these. Look at that. Is that a sleepy hollow nightmare or what? Come on. And we got people protesting this stuff, and they're still pretending like we need to cut our exhaust off in our car. Stop it already. It's time for people to kind of stand up against this and not take the grunt. With them having us pledge to do something to keep the air clean, that's like, uh, psychologically speaking, a matter of projection. Yes, look at this. Look at this. Tarantula crawling across the sky. Very natural. But, and then we got these planes racing each other. They're playing games with genocide. Look at this. They're just having a good time. Like it's some video game. And then we got these. Look at this. This was in Glendale here. We go all the way to the ground. Look at this. This is insanity. Dripping from the sky. Look at this. This is in Long Beach. This, we got microwave frequencies going through it. And then, of course, we got the fun at nighttime spraying with the white and orange chemicals. That's great, huh? There's a natural little phenomenon right there. Anyway, I think we did a good job. What do you think? Yeah, what we're trying to do is awareness. <laughs> and I, I, I would like to stand right in front of that Clean Air Day parade with this poster board. And I think that's a good idea. We've got on our California freeways the same the signs that, um, that alert people to Amber Alerts for child kidnapping. There's flashing on the freeway, it's Clean Air Day, and to not drive on that day. And... I, I just am floored. I hear you. I'm floored by it.
just yeah. looking at these pictures and you know yeah, this is too much look at this look at this pathetic sky oh my god dripping dripping from the sky just look at this it's not even subtle this stuff is dripping down and John you've done some great photography on these thank you very committed <laughs> to clean air over here yes, yes we are here's our California clean air commitment our yeah. commitment is to not give up on putting the blame where it belongs thank you look at this nice and this is our original clouds back in the day a lot of you guys probably forgot about them those but are the ones that you'd lay down on the grass and look up and you know make teddy bears and yeah teddy bears and compare shapes and yeah now these I, days look like they're over John yeah it looks like you'd look up now and it's like oh look Satan great thank you yeah so this ought to work I don't know so if anybody asks be. you not to drive your car on clean air day October 20 or October Focus. 3rd here in California be sure you remember this just keep this in mind because okay. your contribute con your contribution to not driving a car for clean air day is not going to help when they're doing this in the sky not to mention we have some of the highest regulations on smog pollution here and it's just a joke this is the state of catalytic converters let me tell you we're oh. not we're not polluting the sky at all with cigarettes and carbon monoxide from the car it's just not happening guys no it's cow flatulence remember that yeah that one was a good one too you no know, that was a nice try don't make me laugh okay don't make me laugh anyway i think we did a good job here so yeah we did good we did good let's see what we got going all right all right uh over and out getting tired here over and out look at that airplanes do that yeah the, the uh, airport traffic does that all the time hey, look it's jesus really where <laughs> Oh, the cross. Oh, wow. Okay, take care, guys. Bye.